Hello, welcome to another video, and today I have something very intriguing that I want to show with everyone watching today, and uh, basically, as you read in the title, it is a channel that just managed to get over 1 million people to subscribe to it overnight, just completely randomly, without any one of those people having any intent of subscribing to the channel and having any uh, ch uh, decision in the matter, basically. We're going to just investigate and dive right in into exactly how it was able to do this. Now, believe it or not, this happened a long time ago and hardly got any kind of coverage whatsoever. Today, it's still a mystery and I want to finally solve it. So this took place in March of 2017, specifically March 10th. We have a channel which was started on YouTube simply called look at this with all caps except uh, with the first letter L. Almost as if uh, the person writing the title had their caps lock switched and they intended to do it the other way around. You know, like how that happens when you accidentally have the caps lock on and you, you know, whatever, you get the point. So basically, on the day that this channel started, it had basically no subscribers at all. It only really got on the radar of anyone, meaning basically the million people that ended up being forcibly subscribed to it when... Over a month later, it uploaded its first ever video on YouTube, and when it did that, it still only had 2,000 subscribers. So that's already a red flag, as you could probably tell. No channel is really able to gain 2,000 subscribers without having any videos. I'm not sure if that just makes too much sense, or maybe I'm just missing something, but clearly something isn't adding up in this situation. However, once they uploaded this video, that's when things started to take a turn for the crazy side. This video was all caps, just like the title of the channel and the title was what if you never been born so already a little bit strange the grammar is not really uh working out here too well so that caught my attention and also the only reason why this entire situation got my attention to begin with was because i was personally one of the million people that was automatically subscribed to the channel so at this point we're about two months after the channel was created in may of 2017 and I noticed that all of a sudden I was subscribed to a strange looking YouTube channel I'd never seen before and I tweeted it on my Twitter account and this was basically alongside with literally all kinds of other big YouTube channels that were tweeting out the fact that they were subscribed as well. Even Drama Alert tweeted that they were subscribed randomly to this YouTube channel and they had never seen a single one of their videos. Now to look into the details we'll find even more strange aspects of this as well. So, the first thing that's weird is the very first video. If you just watch some of these videos, like, well, there's only two of them on the entire channel, the first one in particular and the second one were all made by the same sounding voice in the background, very loud, overdone music and animations, almost as if they just paid someone to make the video for them. The first video has 54,000 views as of the recording right now, and 24,000 likes with only 1,000 dislikes. Now, if anyone's familiar with how YouTube ratings work, you'll know instantly that that's clearly not too much of a realistic ratio. In order to get almost half of every single person watching your video to leave a like, that would be pretty impressive. I dare you watching this video to do that with this one, but unprovoked without telling people to do that, it's almost impossible. Now, even more interesting from that, if we switch over to the next video titled, What If You Know Everything? Which, uh, like I said, we're still dealing with the extremely weird capitalizations being kind of random within these titles and in the title of the channel itself, obviously. The same style of video, the same length, except this one is a little bit different. It had the exact same amount of dislikes the first one had, which was over a thousand, except this one has even more views than the first video and only 1,000 likes. So clearly, they're botting likes as well as everything else. Both the two videos have the equal amount of comments, and all of the comments are very foreign and strange and basically have no correlation to the video themselves. Alright, so basically at this point, every single aspect of this channel is looking extremely not correct and like it's in the twilight zone or something like that. There's only two videos, both the titles are strange, and the videos themselves don't really make much sense. They look like a reject if they were trying to try out to uh, five minute crafts or something like that. But nonetheless, within the course of three days from May 14th to May 17th of 2017, the channel went from 3,000 subscribers to 1.1 million. Now from the time that I took the screenshot, the channel had already over 600,000 subscribers. And if we take a look at the statistics now, it's still, to this very day, losing subscribers. The farthest back we can see is when the channel had still 570,000 subs. 
uh, back at the beginning of this year. So basically what that means is that over all this time, almost half the amount of people that were automatically subscribed to this channel were basically unsubscribing, because why would they want to subscribe to a channel that they've never seen before? So what is the answer to all this? What is the source of this channel's weirdness? Who's running it? And more interestingly, how did they do this? Because to this day, the channel still has 500,000 subscribers and only 100,000 views. Now, you don't have to be a genius to understand that uh, that doesn't really make much sense. You can't really subscribe to a channel, at least under any normal circumstances, if you had never seen any of their videos. So according to this, uh, one out of every five people that subbed only saw their videos. So something is really, really not connecting. So there is one solution to this problem. The solution is based on how the people were automatically subscribed to begin with. So overnight, the channel gained half their subscribers, and you were just automatically subscribed. Maybe not you, but I was. Well, this was back in 2017, when YouTube's algorithm had still in place a automatic purging system. A YouTube subscriber automatic purging system. Now, essentially, what that means is that YouTube had integrated a new subscriber-based system, which could determine whether or not a channel should have more subscriber numbers, or less subscriber numbers by either taking away or adding subscribers to more accurately reflect the real subscribers whereas the spam botted subscribers and that's why back in the middle of 2016 lots of channels received a day where they lost over 500,000 some some channels that were big enough into the 100,000s in a single day correcting their channel sub count and then only a couple months later the infamous extremely weird YouTube subscriber glitch of where you could simply unsubscribe from a channel and then resubscribe and then unsubscribe again and it would count as two unsubscribers now this actually managed to get a youtube channel to negative 1000 subs on youtube and it was a really memeable event on youtube in youtube's history many people had to this day forgotten about it surprisingly but this whole incident happened only one month after that took place so what happened here i believe is that someone managed to take advantage of this algorithm this youtube subscriber count algorithm and use it to automatically resubscribe a bunch of people on YouTube, tricking YouTube into thinking that they already had those subscribers, except it just wasn't being counted, because that's how YouTube's sub counter actually operated back when it was not abbreviated and whatnot. Nowadays, it would be pretty much impossible to do this, but that's effectively how, in my theory, in my opinion, this channel managed to pull this off because these are not fake subscribers they're actual real people you could tell that every single one of them were automatically subscribed because they interacted with the videos that the channel posted enough so that you could see all kinds of people confused as to exactly what had happened the only thing suspicious in terms of botting would be the viewer and like count on the first video ever maybe the person behind this channel had discovered this glitch and intended to use it to make themselves look famous but then decided to stop after the second video for whatever reason when they realized that it wasn't going to actually give them real engagement. But to this day, this channel was never terminated, so whatever they did to get this many subscribers, it was apparently not against the terms of service. Now this is very interesting considering the fact that just recently there was another humongous channel that just all of a sudden anomalously gained 10.8 million subscribers in a single day, just back in the beginning of this month boosting their channel from 40 million to 50 million. The only thing is, only a week later, they lost exactly the same amount of subs that they gained in those two days' periods of time. So does this mean that this glitch actually secretly exists, hidden somewhere in the code of YouTube? In my opinion, I think it's quite possible, but at the end of the day, I don't think really anyone fully understands it. So that was the incident surrounding the YouTube channel known as Look At This. It's very impressive how to this very day, it's just still up and it just still exists the way it was when it first uh, started happening. Never seen anything like this other than that before. Uh, so clearly a first and apparently a last for YouTube in general. But that's the end of this video. Thanks for watching and I hope you learned something and were entertained by this. My name is Dallas aka Infernus and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.